money with it. I'm a naughty mess. Paparazzi catch my fly, my cock and fresh. My daddy Alabama, mama Louisiana. You mix that Negro with that Creole, make a Texas, 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 make a Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is Beyonce here. That's right, Miss Carter is in the building. Hello. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is Oani and you here and in this video we're going to be, you know, spicing it up a little and I'm going the blonde way today, like, because why not? Why not? Anyway, I'm going to be styling my hair from Yolissa hair and also just like a get ready me type thing. And this is their lace front wig in 27. It was colored by them. So I didn't have to stress or do any of that bleaching, all that. Mm -mm. No, we was bougie today. Okay. Anyway, don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Don't forget to click the bell like button down below so you have notifications every time I post a video. And let's get right into this video. So guys, the hair I'm working with today is from Yolissa Hair and this is their 27 inch, not 27 inch I mean, sorry, the color 27 and their lace front hair in 24 inches and I'm so happy about this because it came colored, it came bleached so I didn't have to do anything at all. I just cut off the ear flaps and I went straight into it. This is like the easiest go-to colored wig ever. I'm just cutting in flaps in my lace closure so that it helps me, you know, apply this very easily. I'm applying my got to be glue all over the perimeter of my hairline and I'm just going to let that dry for a minute and then apply my lace on. So speaking of Beyonce guys, recently I've just been in this positive loop in my mind space and i've just been channeling like different strong women and i believe that you know me channeling beyonce has like brought a lot of inspiration to me in just like this few weeks i just you know i've been picking out different people to just learn more about them and their patterns and how they do things so i can emulate you know I don't know but it's working for me because I've just been a positive ball these days guys I will speak more about that at the end so stay to the end if you're after interested. blow drying it I went ahead to just put a wrap on top of it so it lays it flat and then using the blow dryer to kind of melt it down into my skin so it looks you know natural enough and as you can see it did a job but I still had to fix some parts you see later in the video i'm just cutting out the laces from the hairline the excess lace and i'm using this tiny scissors for this i think these are called i don't know shears yes and i'm going back in with my blow dryer just to make sure everything is on deck and on point and is knit now i'm not trying to do baby hairs i'm just trying to make the front look neater so i did cut it like i was doing baby hairs but you really can't do baby hairs with this wig um with this color i mean but you can if you want but it will just look crazy so i'm just trying to you know make the front line look neat and just bring it into the hair neatly i don't know how that turned out but later on it worked out guys trust me it worked out yes yeah, so now i'm applying some heat protectant and i'm using my hot comb just to you know go through the lace so it's flat enough i decided on a side part here 
and i i was confused later on you guys will see now i'm just you know going over the side parts just to make sure it's precise and you know the c curve i like to do a c curve now i'm going in with my powder my fancy powder and my mac studio fix powder in nw50 and i'm using my toothbrush just to go over where the part is because i really didn't want to do any more coloring jobs on this hair i felt like it was even okay the way it was i just didn't wait to see how it was when i styled it i felt like this week could have done without the coloring thing i did so here i was confused i'm like wait do i want a center part or do i want a side part and this is where the dilemma starts guys anyway i'm running through it with my hot comb then i switch back to the side part and i was like huh i don't know something doesn't look right about this hair okay let me add some curls let me see what's going on let's see how we can work this out okay we shall work hard we shall try our best let's curl it okay i use my wand i'll leave a link down below if you're interested in it and yeah curling curling guys i don't know why but i feel like i'm the only one that still believes in new year resolutions like every year i make new resolutions some i follow through some i don't but each year i'm still hopeful and i'm still like I still have the energy and I'm like, yeah, let's go, let's go. Yeah, so while I, after I was done with the curls, I just went into, you know, finish up my makeup. If you're interested in the makeup tutorial, just check it out on my Instagram page and you'll see it all in details. I just wanted to show you guys a little bit of how the look came out and I love it. Thank you, Fenty. But yeah, okay, moving on to my hair that now looks gorgeous. I was just like, oh my God, this hair is absolutely stunning stunning anyway i went in with my hot comb just to try and get the flyaways in place and now i'm brushing out my curls because i like my curls loose i don't like my curls tight i tried as much as possible to brush it out but yeah this was what it looked like it will still fall later on i think maybe in the week but so far i'm on my beyonce i'm on my mrs carter you know Res put some respect on me. Look at her. Damn. Thank you. <laughs> Bye. Yes, guys, that's it for this look. Oh my god, I was so scared. This look went left so many times in this video. I just thought it wasn't going to be lit, but. <laughs> Girl, you're Beyonce. What are you, what are you saying? <laughs> Sorry, guys. I almost forgot who I was. But yeah, it turned out great. I love it. Am I going back to black? No. Am I staying blonde? Yes. For how long? I don't know. But yeah, let's see how that goes. Okay. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, click the bell like button down below. Don't forget to follow me on my social media accounts Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter. Let's get this popping. Okay. Yeah. So be my inner Beyonce is coming into my light. She embodies her path and I'm picking one or twos from her. Do the math. Be my Beyonce is putting on my freakum dress. Be my hardworking self. Embracing my talents and wearing them as a halo. Letting go of my ego. Striving to the top. Staying on top. No distractions, no competitions, just art formations. I speak it, I manifest it. One is Beyonce year, 2020 was green.
soul. I 